What's good, y'all? What's going on? Did y'all see them Eagles lose last night? It's a beautiful thing. Always a beautiful thing when the Philadelphia Eagles lose. The reason why I said it because I'm a Cowboy fan. It helps the Dallas Cowboys. Now, DJ Wagner from Camden, New Jersey, the number one player in the class of 2023. He made a commitment and he chose Kentucky over Louisville. Now, both schools was jockeying to get DJ Wagner. Kentucky, John Calipari, he was the coach of DJ Wagner's father, DeWan Wagner, in 2000, 2001. He hired DeWan Wagner's father, Milt Wagner, to a job. So you fast forward to 2022, Milt Wagner, the grandfather to DJ Wagner, he gets a job at his old school at Louisville. So they all, all these moving parts to land one, one superstar athlete. At the end of the day, DJ picked his father's coach, which is John Calipari, which is Kentucky, but he really picked the coach, John Calipari, because his dad has, still has a relationship with John Calipari. And if you know how this thing goes, if DJ shows anything at Kentucky, any kind of upside, and he will, then he's going to the NBA after the season. It'd be a short stay at Kentucky, probably six months. This is how it works. It'd be too much money to pass up. Now he signed a Nike deal, NIL deal. He has some other things in the works. So it's gonna be too much money for him to do more than one year of college basketball. I uh, like the way House Father kept him in the city. Camden is no, no joke. Keep that hunger. He's well protected in Camden. And he's played against the best players in high school. He showed out at the Nike camp over the summer. He was like 20 points a game last year and four assists, four rebounds, four steals. So he's the consummate point guard. So I'm going to wish him nothing but success going forward. And he's going to do a great job at Kentucky. He won't flip on his uh, commitment either.